his long life, I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. Psalm 91 verse 16 Celebrating one's birthday all started with the Egyptians. Scholars who study the Bible say that the earliest mention of a birthday was around 3,000 years before the Christian era, and it was in reference to a Pharaoh's birthday. In the modern times, remembering one's birthday is a big celebration. For us, life is our existence, and thus, Life must be celebrated, and we must be grateful to God for the gift of life. A good reason to ignore birthdays is that it can all become a bit repetitive, you know, food preparation, activities, as we end up doing exactly what we did last year and probably at the exact same venue, didn't we? Although there are more imaginative ways to celebrate this important occasion, but then the preparation puts us under pressure to find something exciting and different like this virtual birthday celebration my friend Arlene on YouTube. The Birthday Cake the story behind having cake on one's birthday can be traced back to the ancient Greeks who burned candles as offerings to their gods and goddesses. For birthdays, they baked round honey cakes to symbolize the moon and topped them off with candles as a special way to pay tribute to the moon goddess Artemis. That was their birth as God. Ancient Greeks borrowed the tradition but rightfully realized that a desert would make the celebration more meaningful. So they baked moon-shaped cakes to offer up as tribute to moon goddess Artemis. Hence, this is the most probably the reason why we light our birthday cakes on fire. Traditionally, the person on her or his birthday, she or he makes a wish, which is thought to come through 
if all the candles are extinguished in a single breath. To represent a sharing of joy and a sense of togetherness, the cake is shared among all the guests attending the party. Having all of you viewers, friends, and families over to celebrate Arlene's birthday virtually. She will let you eat this cake with toppings, not icing, of her favorite dishes. Beef steak, stewed salmon head, garnished with your favorite vegetables and seasoned with tamarind paste. Roasted fish and pinak bit. And of course, with her favorite desserts, buku salad. There is nothing to worry about the fats and carbs you may have. It is just a virtual rice cake we can enjoy as we enjoy watching this virtual celebration. So, let this green rice cake and the dessert be whatever it's going to be. After all, it's just one day. So, guys, let's have some fun. Senenses or Gomamela symbolizes Arlene's refinement, thoughtfulness, and mature charm. It also symbolizes proud, glorious femininity, lasting beauty, and a happy life. It is an indicative of bonds of affection and it is symbolic of promptness. Giving Arlene the gift of a viscous rosa sinensis. Her favorite flower is just a way to celebrate her birthday. Giving these flowers to her is also a way of celebrating that special day when she was born. These hibiscus flowers in different colors make a great birthday gift on her 40th birthday celebration. Whether you are celebrating with someone or not, the gift of birthday flowers really shows that we came for her. The green balloons on Arlene's birthday convey congratulations and celebration of hope in this new normal life despite the pandemic, especially when wishing her a happy and blessed birthday. Please type your wishes for our birthday celebrator or celebrant, Arlene, in the comment section or live chat. As she celebrates her 40th birthday, she starts her life anew. Celebration of her 40th birthday connotes with this famous expression, life begins at 40. It doesn't mean she has turned back into childhood again, but it means that she reaches the age of 40 and her life becomes better. It is because she has acquired the skills and experiences necessary for an enjoyable life on earth with her real family and virtual family on YouTube and other social media platforms. So be with her and enjoy life for life is short.